country COVID-19 is Cain and Abel. The parents are Adam and Eve. Um, the children are Cain and Abel. Cain got jealous because God accepted Abel's offering. I learned how to sing properly and I learned some of the songs in the hymn book. We gave my quiz, sang songs, did local at home. Remember the Sabbath day, keep the Sabbath day holy, and fight the good fight. I doubt if something's, happen if something's happening, God will save us. I learned the Testaments and the Commandments, and I learned the how to keep the Sabbath holy and I learned a lot about um, the commandments and to walk your talk. I have learned was an English sermon talking about choosing your chains. There were five main words C for choice, H for habit, A for automatic, I for identity, and N for nature, spelling chain. In life we are given choices. It's our choice to do whatever you want, whether it's a good or bad choice. When you like what you are doing, it becomes a habit, something that you like doing for a living, but if you do it all the time, it's an automatic thing, something you do that follows you everywhere. Sometimes it even becomes your identity, who you are or things you do in life, but once you've gone through all those steps, it becomes nature, an everyday thing. Well, we learned our memory verses for Sabbath, which we didn't do before. And we sang songs for our, for Angasa and Angri Mao. And yeah, it felt good to use our voice for God. One thing that I've learned during the lockdown was a, was a sermon about storms. Storms refer to the many struggles we go through in life. And here are ways we can get through these storms. S for survive, T for thrive, O for options, R for robust, M for motivate. What I've learned during quarantine was a sermon long from Pastor Johnny. And his sermon was talking about storms. Each letter rep represents a word. S, survive. Knowing that you can, that you have been in a situation where you couldn't go any further, but you made it. T. Thrive. Telling yourself that you can push your limits to reach higher things, higher things in life. O. Options. Just know that you have so many choices, options to choose from. R. Is robust. Don't be the person to be controlled by someone and know that you can bust your way out and do things your way. M is motivate. You and I can be a supporter or someone that can motivate others to do better. What makes me happy is my family. Staying with my family, doing checks church at home and eating a lot. Five bases, I five 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 Playing and walking around, eating chocolate and chicken and cheese. One thing that we can just do locally at home. 
because you can still go um, local. I bet we didn't need to um, go to school. Um, something that makes me happy is listening to music, um, spending time with my family. Something that makes me happy is that I know all my family everywhere is safe and nothing bad has happened to them. Being with our family and learning um, memory verses together and learning songs. One thing that makes me happy is spending time with my family and talking with each other. Spending time with those you trust and love, like my family and close friends, and doing things that can keep me motivated in life. listen to your parents doing fair hours at home because that's what we do Salavo, yata to fire le finamalo, alea tua, a o mawa le lea wa no, salavo mo yesu. Listen to DJs. Listen to their fall down. Help them. Um, remember to keep the Sabbath day holy. I will tell them to not steal and to not lie, because when you steal stuff from anyone's house or from the shop, shops, God will be um, mad at you. So, um, I think then, uh, speak the truth and don't be judgmental and don't talk behind other people's back and be friendly to each other and get along. So always trust in the Lord and never lose faith upon Him because He will help you with anything and everything. To never lose faith, trust in the Lord and that God will always be there for you through the storms in your life, in our in life. Well, my dad always said to us to always put God first and to listen to your parents and you will live longer. Don't let anyone judge you for who you are or what you look like or where you come from and the way you do things differently to others because there's only one judge you can. Judge, judge us, and that's our Father in Heaven. Lord God Almighty, You are clothed with majesty. The heavens declare your wonders For you are great and marvelous things For you alone are God There is no one else like you Let the nations declare that you Yeah.